Hi, this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Arcana. Last time, we just defeated the Stone Guardian. For with defeating him, we gained access to the second floor of the Temple of Balnea. Three, four. And uh, I'm here to take you through it. So, here we go. Let's go after those guys. I'm going to use a single water card here to help out against the uh, fire enemies. It's also actually decent against uh, wind elemental enemies too. Not as good against fire, but it's pretty good. And there we go. All the other hallways I just passed up lead to dead ends, so I'm just skipping those for now. The thing about Lightning 1 is that it hits all your party members one at a time. And what's so hard about making a spell hit everyone all at once? It just takes longer and spreads it out. But whatever. That's the way it is. Another thing that's interesting is that when uh, you dodge an attack, your characters will say, That's the best you can do! Or if you uh, deal a critical hit, they'll say, Take that! So it adds a little emotion and flavor to the battles. Uh, I really don't care for it myself, but it's eh, different, I guess. Got it. I'm moving through this a little quicker than I usually do, but that's, that's good. It's not so much that Lightning One deals a lot of damage. I mean, it doesn't really, it's almost negligible, but it, it just takes a while for it to cast. Virgins are so annoying. And she learned a spell that is almost useless. The Return Ring, um, can be useful. What it does is it uh, it's like an exit spell. It returns you to the town outside of the, uh, the dungeon that you're in. Um, I'm not going to use it here because I just want to get to the end. I want to finish this dungeon sometime today. The high encounter rate is killing me. God. I'd use my water cards here, but water is pretty useless against Earth. So we just gotta take these guys out, one at a time. Still no spirits. I thought I came here to kill spirits, but I guess I was wrong. Led astray. All these little hallways here have a chest, so I'm just going to quickly uh, go after it. Yeah, let's get the Gurchin first. Or not. Get at least two of them. Thank you. That's the we weird thing about this game. Spells can actually miss. Uh, it's just really odd. And Rook's gained a lot of level. You learned Attack Impair. This spell's actually uh, mildly useful against boss fights. Um, I don't use it in regular battles, random battles, simply because it, the battles are too short for it to really be useful. But uh, here, it, it can be pretty useful. Uh, in boss battles, that is. And what it does is it reduces uh, their attack power by 10%, which in a normal battle isn't that useful, but in, say, a boss battle, it's going to take a long time, so, you know, over the long run, it can actually be pretty useful. I think I might want to heal soon. Keep an eye on that. Some herbs that I'll save for later. I might use them, I don't know. Defend. Die. There you go. 
Uh, I'm making decent time here. Let's see what I can do. I'm pretty sure I'll be able to make it to the boss. Let's see. Okay, now I believe this is the second hallway on, uh, second to the last hallway on the right, if I'm not mistaken. That's the best you can do. Well, at least on the bright side, their spells can miss, too. Okay. Almost there. Let's do some water cards, since I'm almost there anyway. Another irritating thing about this game. Your both you and your enemies can get two attacks in a row. It just, just seems to be random who gets the next attack. Oh my god. Well, at least the spells hit them all. Or at least they target them. One water card takes care of all of them. That's some magic card. And we get another level, just in time. Lightning one, that'll be... Ah. Uh, that'll be pretty useful, coming up soon. Now again, you would never know that the boss fight is coming up, but... I do, so... Elemental again. I'm not going to use attack impair because this battle is going to go pretty quickly. And my spell missed. Again. Spirit controlling this guy? I don't see any spirits. Try again. And my phone's ringing, but too bad. I'm almost done. I'm not re recording this thing. Okay, well, I'm almost out of time here, so uh, we're almost at the end. So um, we'll see you next time on Let's Play Arcana. This is H.C. Bailey, signing off.